John, three and three, not a bad start to your Lincoln career. You must be delighted with your, your personal goal scoring tally so far. Yeah, personally, it's, um, it's been good. Obviously, as a team, I think um, we could have obviously picked up some more points. I think the performance at Burn and the performance at MK probably warranted a little bit more, but we need to, um, we need to cut out individual errors and, and sloppy goals and, and get a bit better in the final third to to not just be scoring the one. So um, we need to add to that. But on a personal level, to, to score three and three is a, is a good start. But I'm, I'm looking to add more and and uh, turn them turn them goals into winning goals. And all three of the goals very similar in terms of runs into the six-yard box and, and getting that final touch. Is that the, the message from the manager for you to be that man that Lincoln have missed this year? Um, yeah, it's sort of the managers. You know, when I spoke to him first, first of all, it was... It was clear that a lot of balls go into that area, and you know I think my personnel and, and the way I play that that suits my game, and that, and that was a big reason why I wanted to come here. Was I saw the chances that were being created and the areas that, that the balls were putting in, and it is it's something that suits my game. Um, to be honest, throughout my whole career, I've scored a lot of goals, and I'd say the majority of them have all been in and around six yard boxes. Very few I can count that are been outside the area, they normally um, crosses into the box or, or being slipped in. Um, so I know that's that's where my strength lies, getting in them positions and, and having good movement and good timing to get into them areas at the right time. And then it's down to me to get good contact and finish them. So uh, thankfully I've been doing that as far and I'm going to keep getting in the areas and, and as long as the ball's still going in them, I'll, I'll, I'll be open to get on the end of a lot more. And as you mentioned, those goals that you know that are in and around the box, how important is the quality of the the wide players for you to 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 be able to to do what you need to do? Yeah, obviously that that helps massively. You know, the I call it the final action before the finish, and and that's very important. But obviously, the pass into them needs to be right as well. And it's it's all about timing and timing of your run, timing of your movement. Um, you know, the weight of pass, the type of pass it is, it, it all determines what kind of finish it leaves for me at the end. And um, so far, the service has been good. Um, so sort of probably had them three goals that I've scored have probably been the three chances that I've had. I've had a couple of other maybe half chances at, at best in the Burton game, but there's probably not many more. But um, them balls across, flash across the box, it's down to me and, and, you know, the opposite wide man, maybe a midfielder and, and Liam or whoever's playing in the number 10 to arrive in the box as well. So so the person crossing it's got good options to, to pick people out. The manager's talked about being up for a, a battle over the next few weeks with the, the games coming up against teams in and around. Do you, do you feel from what you've seen in the squad so far that you're the type of team who can battle to, to get points? Yeah, definitely. You know, it's... You know, you look at our DNA and, and what we are about. We're, we are a football inside. We, we're a possession-based side. and um, But there's, you know, lots of different ways to win a game. And, you know, it might not be as pretty or as, you know, pleasing on the eye as we might want it to be. But at the end of the day, it's about winning games. And um, you look at some teams that are doing really well in this league. Uh, they're maybe not so possession-based. And they're just very physical when it comes to, you know, the first and second balls, winning their duels, winning their headers. You know, basic things of the game, which from whatever level you're playing at, if you don't do them, you're not going to win games. And and I do see that in us that we've got we've got the ability to do that. We've got some strong players, we've got physical players, we've got players that cover a lot of ground. Um, and we need to bring all of that, not just for the next game and the games coming up. We need to bring that for the rest of the season. Um, but we know the importance of Tuesday and and the games in weeks to come. But our main aim is tomorrow night and and a home game where. We would want to turn the two last performances and results, which haven't warranted the points we want. We want to turn that into a win, um, whatever way it means. It can be scrappy, it can be low and lacking quality, but um, as long as we get on the right end of the result, that's all that matters.